Okay, holy shit, guys. This is Pitching Ace 88, and we are about to have some fun with this shit right here. Uh, I got this game, pre ordered it, got the uh, fucking uh, classic pack or whatever it's on top of it, which will be fucking sweet. Obsidian Entertainment. I've been waiting for this game for a long time. I just cleared up a whole bunch of space on my, de on my hard drive, so I should have a good 500 gigs recording, which means it should be uh, very smooth, which is what I'm hoping for. And look at that. I mean, holy shit, dude, that looks freaking awesome. Um, language may be appropriate because this is going to be uh, unedited. Um, this will be my first time playing through this. Uh, I just ran it just to see if it would work, at least the beginning. Uh, the settings, I have already uh, messed with them a little bit in terms of uh, same controls I'm using on Fallout 3. Voice is all the way up. Master, I may decrease it a little bit. Um, see if I can... Okay, my sensitivity is good. Gameplay is good. Oh, look at the money. Dude, everything in this game just looks amazing. Um, this is a game brought to you by GameAnyone.com. And let's start this shit up. And let's... I've never played this. I haven't even done the preview. So I'm going to enjoy the, watching this as you guys are. Revolting cocktail, ha. Huh? I got that little catchphrase right there. Holy shit. Is this fucking kill zone? Oh god, I want that. Oh, I want that so bad. Oh shit. You just got popped. changes. When atomic fire consumed the earth, those who survived did so in great underground vaults. When they opened, their inhabitants set out across the ruins of the old world to build new societies, establishing villages, forming tribes. As decades passed, what had been the American Southwest united beneath the flag of the new California Republic, dedicated to old world values of democracy and the rule of law. As the Republic grew, so did its needs. Scouts spread east, seeking territory and wealth in the dry and merciless expanse of the Mojave Desert. They returned with tales of a city untouched by the warheads that had scorched the rest of the world and a great wall spanning the Colorado River. The NCR mobilized its army and sent it east to occupy Hoover Dam and restore it to working condition. But across the Colorado, another society had arisen under a different flag. A vast army of slaves forged from the conquest of 86 tribes, seat Four years have passed since the Republic held the dam, just barely, against the Legion's onslaught. The Legion did not retreat. Across the river, it gathers strength. Campfires burn. Training drums beat. Through it all, the New Vegas Strip has stayed open for business, under the control of its mysterious overseer, Mr. House, 
and his army of rehabilitated tribals and police robots. You are a courier hired by the Mojave Express to deliver a package to the New Vegas Strip. What seemed like a simple delivery job has taken a turn for the worse. Looks like Ron Perlman's this, uh, you got I think, what you the narrator. Rat, so pay up. You're crying in the rain, oh, Pally. Shit. All right. <laughs> Guess who's waking up over here? Time to cash out. What? Will you get it over with? Maybe cons kill people without looking them in the face. But I ain't a fink. You've made your last delivery, kid. Sorry you got twisted up in this scene. What? From where you're kneeling must seem like an 18-carat run of bad luck. Truth is, the game was rigged from the start. Alright, well, sorry about the, uh, I might have be piecing together a little bit, because it seems like whenever I'm in the beginning of a game, it always screws up a little bit. But, uh, okay, so here's the, here's the classic pack I was trying to tell you guys about. So, Canteen, Weather Pistol, got some new stuff. You're awake. How about that? Oh, I put on subtitles, too, for you guys. Whoa, easy there, easy. You've been out cold a couple of days now. Why don't you just relax a second? Get your bearings. Let's see what the damage is. How about your name? Can you tell me your name? I've got to say, it's a pretty good, uh, pretty good graphic so far. I do kind of like the art style. The other one was uh, green. The, the Fallout, what I was doing with mods, was kind of clear. Um, so I'm going to be pitching H88, of course. And of course, this is going to be... Uh, you trying to figure out who in the world you are, so we, uh, I guess we're gonna have to try and create ourselves. <laughs> I can't say it's what I'd have picked for you, but if that's your name, that's your name. It is, Pitching I'm Doc Mitchell. Welcome to Good Springs. Now, I hope you don't mind, but I had to go rooting around there in your noggin to pull all the bits of lead out. I take pride in my needlework. But you'd better tell me if I left anything out of place. Of course. How'd I do? I do kind of like you. You're noticing as he was talking, I was kind of moving up and down. Well, you did notice that I was a guy. That's always that's always a good thing. He knew I was he knew I was a Caucasian. That's good. Um. No. No. Definitely not. No. No. No, no, none of these. Oh, yeah, he looks pretty cool. Uh, I'll go with the. I'll, hey, you know what? We got. We're, we're in Vegas. That's a little bit of the El Elvis. Uh, Elvis look. Eh, I'll be a little seasoned. Uh, no, I kind of like that actually. We'll keep that. Yes, I would like this to be my character. Well, I got most of it right anyway. Stuff that mattered. Yeah, you did. Okay. No sense keeping you in bed anymore. Let's see if we can get you on your feet. Uh, that doesn't look like that much, Doc. Good. Why don't you walk down to the end of the room? Over by that bigger tester machine there. Take it slow now. It ain't a race. Alright. So. Let's, uh, have a gander. Uh, like anything, you can basically pick up a lot of stuff in the world. Can we take Doctor's Bag? Oh, we can. It's actually a pretty good value. Um, value four. Let's pick it up now. Because, uh, I, I mean, I'll, I might be... Ooh. Ah, I don't have it. Okay. Um, Sarsaparilla apparently looks like it's, it might be something that we'll be drinking. Let's, uh, do I have still the Pip-Boy light? 
apparently not. Not yet. Broken. Okay. I might hmm. play this, probably play this one. Ooh, blood pack. Surgical tubing. Medics. Wonder Looking if I good so far. Let's rat packs. Stim packs. Stim packs. Pack. Right quick if you got back all your faculties. Ooh, anti venom. That's probably gonna be uh, scrap metal was useful useful in the other game. Wonder if it's in this game. Uh, I would appreciate it if you guys did not tell me, because I do want this to be blind. Um, drain energy sale and laser pistol. I have 200. Okay. Well, he wants us to do this thing. Oh, that's kind of cool. Let's check our eyes. Yeah, whatever. Okay, so this is going to be, uh, I'm assuming... Strength. Um, I don't. You know, I might actually go lightweight this time. Wait, we got perception, of course, endurance. Let's see, perception is um, knows when there's a little stick of dynamite nearby. Lock pick. I really want to put a couple of those in. Unarmed health, resistance, and survival. Seems somewhat important. Charisma. Barter, speech, companion, and nerve. I, you know, I'm going to abuse quick save a little bit. I could probably take a couple points out of there. Intelligence. Sk science repair. I'm going to be a know-it-all. I'm actually, I am actually, since I'm not uh, first time playing through, I am actually going to do a lot in intelligence. Uh, endurance, perception, strength. We're going to put strength up to four. And lockpick, we're going to get another in perception. And that's about, I think, all she wrote. Oh, shoot, agility. Action point. Eh, I don't care about that actually that much. Oh, I didn't even think about luck. All skills, critical hits, enemy mishaps. Charisma. Let's go down more. Intelligence, I do want to keep up. I actually am not going to do sneak a whole lot. So we'll just put three. Luck, though, I do kind of like luck. Oh, whoops, I can put one more. Where do I want to put it in? Um, we'll put it in agility. Alright. Huh. Must be some frontal lobe damage. Well, we know your vitals are good. But do? that don't mean them bullets didn't leave you nutter than a bighorn and drop it. Okay, now let's see if we can pick this up. A seat <sighs> in the couch and we go through a couple of questions. See if your dogs are still barking. I don't have a pit boy. Damn it. Sucks. All right, now I gotta answer some stupid questions. First, a baseball glove. We'll take those just because those are cool. I need a damn pit boy. Ooh, pre-war book. I'll take that. Another pre-war book. I hope that's useful. Ooh, pre-war book. Is useful in another game. No reason it shouldn't be now. Pre-war book. Pre-war book. Oh, another pre-war book. Where is it? Pre-war book. Nope. Don't want that. Uh, pre-war book up here, though. Pre-war book. Ha, <laughs> dude. If this... I'd love to... I can't, I can't even... I wonder if it's... Ex no, it's not escape. I'm pretty sure I put it in the right. I'm going to quick save actually right now. Before I do anything. 